This is Danny from Jackrabbits Barbers and today we're going to be doing Team's hair. Team, what are we going to do today? We're going to do a nice tight skin fade on it, Danny, and then a thin out on the top where it's nice and thick and just take some weight out. Cool, nice. Let's do it. Start my skin fade with a T-liner all around. Keep it nice and low. So because Tim isn't, like, so Tim doesn't like to to use the foil on his skin because he's more regular. He comes every week, so we're only, only gonna go down to this short. We're not gonna go shorter. I'm not going to go too high with the grey too because I'm going to do some clipper overcome. And I'm always playing around in between as well, so let's do a one and a half or a 1.2, whichever needs. I'm gonna use the wall signals and there's a half, uh, yeah, 0.5 grade on it. It can take even shorter. And then eventually we take off the grades and do an open blade and try to knock out these yeah. lines. Fastest growing hair in Manchester. Probably. <laughs> That's why you need to come every week. Yeah. But yeah, I always open the blade and close it so there isn't like a strict rule that I go around with the zero and then open it a little bit and go around there with that one and then do a one around is is constantly like open it and close it. That's the thing I don't want to copy anybody I just try to I mean obviously I watch all the guys and I watch like YouTube videos or whatever but I never try to copy one thing I always Try to find my way. own way. Yeah. It's nice for the client though when you get the same cut from the same barber. All the guys are great barbers and you get a great cut, but where Danny does mine so often, we've got it, you know, we know exactly. You've built a relationship, yeah. Yeah, we know, Danny knows <laughs> what works for me. As soon as I've done the actual face part of the haircut, and as I said earlier, we have this kind of line left in the middle we're gonna just do with a clipper over comb it working mate yeah. by using a classic technique just club cut it basically make it nice and even everywhere and then um, I'm just gonna texturize it after I dried it so I'm not where I come in every week hey Danny yeah make it nice and even every week 
got really, really thick hair. I don't like too much weight in it. Just a little bit taken out. Yeah. That's why I just do club cut all around and then just after I dry the blow dry it in place, I'm just gonna use the thinning scissors and take a lot of weight out. Just taking off all these little corners. Scissor over form, just to finish it up on the sides. Can we get them all the time? Religion, on the yeah, brick, yeah. I'd really appreciate yeah, I'll pick you out something with some decent wood. What you can do, sand them up and sand them. Yeah. And, um, yeah. We did that. Yeah. Uh, she was a new theory with us. Yeah. So she's actually about to buy a plot of land to build um, basically her own house, but instead of brick and stuff, she's using old uh, cargo containers. Yeah. You buy these cargo containers. I'm just going to get a nice round brush and blow it to place. So I'm just going around all over with the thinning scissor just to make it nice and choppy. No strict rules about it, no sectioning, just literally going over a few places. It makes it nice and randomly choppy. Just getting these the cut throat just to make a nice hairline. Not I don't want to take too much out of the hairline. taken out of these few hairs. Don't need it there. Cool. Nice and straight. Just gonna pop some map I made on him from uppercut. Cool. Happy? Super happy. <laughs> <laughs> Beardbrain is a premium men's grooming company with products not only for your beard, but also your hair and body. Do yourself a favor and head over to beardbrand.com and take care of yourself. Or you can stick around and watch a few more of our awesome videos.